Want to get fit in the new year? Don't know where to start? They say it takes 21 days to create a new habit. Whether it's to start moving more, start moving again, or even just moving into a better mindset. Join us on our 21 day challenge. Work on creating new habits, stay consistent, get in the best shape of your life and feel amazing. All workouts are beginner friendly for all levels and can be done from anywhere with minimal equipment. Make this year your most fit yet. Welcome to day 19 of the 21 day challenge. Oh my, you are so close. This is amazing. Today's class is all about recovery, breathing, and stretching the muscles because they're probably feeling a little tense and they need a little love. Let's do it. This class will be super chill. You don't need anything but your body and a yoga mat. And we're gonna stretch, we're gonna breathe, and we're gonna get ready to finish the challenge strong. Let's do it. All right, so let's get grounded. Sit up nice and tall. Start to become aware of the breath. Notice the inhale, notice the exhales. Notice if you're carrying tension throughout the body. Don't worry, we'll get to the stretches. We're gonna stretch out every little part of the body, but see if you can energetically just release any tension through your breath work. Beautiful, and then opening up the eyes, let's circle into the wrists, massaging out and circling out, stretching out the wrists. And when we're lifting weights a lot, the wrists get a little tired, they get a little sore. So let's do a little bit of wrist mobility. From there, you're gonna clap your hands together and we're gonna keep working into those wrists. So we're going into these circles as those hands are clapped together. Good. From there, you're gonna inhale the arms up, big stretch, and then you're gonna take your left hand to your right knee, looking behind the right shoulder, rooting down through the sits bones, but sitting up nice and tall, gazing through the right side of the body. Inhaling, taking those arms up, and then exhaling, switch. Inhale back to center, exhale back to the right. And last time, inhale, big reach up, exhale, Swiss. Amazing. Inhale, you're gonna bring your arms up and exhale, we're gonna come into a nice passive forward fold. Reaching the forehead down, releasing the neck. Taking another breath in here, inhale and exhale. Slowly, slowly come right back up. Good, let's extend those legs out. Shake it out, let the blood flow. And then take the left foot to the inside of the right inner thigh. We're gonna stretch to the hamstrings. So inhale, take your arms up and exhale, reach forward towards that right toe. Well, toes, you have more than one on the right side. Keeping the spine really long. Inhale. And exhale. Bring that right foot to meet the left. Before we do the other side, we're gonna stretch out the shoulders. Inhale, take the right arm underneath the left. Clap your hands together, eagle stretch. Inhale, reach those elbows up. And exhale, release. Good, and then let's switch sides. So take the left leg forward. Bring that right foot to the inside of the inner thigh. Inhale, take those arms up. Exhale, reach forward. Noticing the difference between both sides. So how tight is one leg and the other? You know, my left side is really tight. So I like to stay here just a little longer to loosen up that leg. Inhale. And exhale, let's cross that left leg over now and let's do the other side. So bring your left underneath the right to stretch out those shoulders in the back of your body. Inhale, bring those arms up. 
Exhale, release, good, shake it out. We're gonna come to all fours. We're gonna stretch out the wrist even more now. So turn your fingertips towards you, come back to tabletop, and we're gonna just push the hips back and up. So wherever that feels good for you, that means you can even be a little further away or you can be a little closer, which won't feel as tight. So I'm gonna set my hands just a little further away and I'm gonna push right back onto my heels to stretch out those wrists. For five, four, three, two, and one. I'm gonna sit back towards my heels and I'm gonna stretch out my arms. So I'm gonna go into the shoulder stretch. So I'm gonna stretch here, the shoulder and the bicep. So we use those arms a lot this week with all the planks and the bicep curls and the shoulder presses. So it's a really nice stretch to release that. And then switch sides. Good, let's stretch out those triceps, the back of those arms. And switch. And then let's take both of the hands behind the head and open up the front of the chest, the pecs, and reach over to the right and over to the left. Nice, strong stretch on the right side of the body. Beautiful. From there, coming into tabletop. Let's go into cat and cow. Inhale, let's do some spine mobility. Exhale. Inhale, open up. Exhale, round. One more time, inhale. And exhale. From there, we're gonna step the right foot in between the hands. You're gonna take both of your hands to the inside of your leg and you're gonna lift the back leg up. So this is kind of like a runner, call this a lizard stretch. You wanna shift your weight forward and back. I like this because I can also stretch out the calf on the left leg. So as I push my heel back, I'm feeling this nice stretch in the calf. And then as I push forward, I'm feeling a nice stretch in the inner thigh, in the right, in the glutes, in the hips. From there, I'm gonna take my hand on my head. I'm gonna go into this opener. So I'm gonna bring the elbow down and then lift up. Elbow brings it down and lift up for three, two, and one. Taking the hands down, take the left knee down. You're gonna straighten out the right leg and flex the toes. You wanna have both of your hands to the insides of that foot. Feeling that nice stretch back in the hamstrings. Might not be so nice, but it's needed. For three, for two, and one. Let's switch. Take that left foot in between those hands. So you wanna go right to the outside of your left arm. Tuck the toes under, lift the right knee up into this lizard stretch. And again, we're gonna shift that weight forward and back. So we're gonna go from calf on the right to inner thigh, inner thigh in the glute. For three, two, and one. Take the left hand on the head. Let's scoop under. Let's get into the upper body's mobility now. They call this the world's greatest stretch because it really targets so many different muscles. And it's dynamic for two and one. Let's take that left hand down, straighten out the left leg. Make sure both of your hands are on the inside of your leg on your left inner thigh and let's stretch out that hamstring that tight tight hamstring for most people take another breath in inhale and exhale awesome work let's take that left leg back and we're gonna move the knees back an inch and we're gonna shift the weight forward and come into Cobra Stretch. Inhale, let's lengthen out the abdominals, open up the chest, open up the heart. Look behind the right shoulder. Look behind the left shoulder to that beautiful sunset and then let's go into Child's Pose. We're gonna start our breath work here. So a few breaths in Child and then a few seated to close off this class. Bring your forehead down. Take all the pressure off. Sink, surrender, relax.
And then slowly come back into a seated position to close off our class with some breath work by the ocean. So closing your eyes, sitting up nice and tall. I want you to inhale for eight, hold for four, and out for eight. So these are really deep, deep breaths. So you wanna send the breath into the lower belly, into the sits bones, into the groin. And let's let all the air out together. Inhale for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hold it. Exhale for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Again, inhale for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hold it. Exhale for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. This time we're gonna cut in half and we're gonna do four and four. So inhaling for one, two, three, four. Hold it, squeeze your abdominals, solar plexus energy is fired up. Exhale for four, three, two, one. Hold it at the bottom, be still. Inhale for one, two, three, four, hold it, exhale for four, three, two, one, hold it. And the last one is in for two, out for two. So in for two, hold for two, out for two, hold for two. So this speeds things up and then we'll do an exhale to finish this off. So inhale for one, two, hold for one, two, exhale, one, two, hold for one, two. Inhale, one, two, hold for one, two, exhale, one, two, hold for one, two. Again, inhale, one, two, hold for one, two, exhale, one, two, Hold for one, two, amazing. Together, let's inhale, big breath in. And then exhale, open the mouth and sigh it out. Ha. Bring your hands to prayer at Heart Center. Thank you for working so hard with me. I am so incredibly proud of you, how far you've come along. You know, by now it's basically a habit, so keep moving and I'll see you tomorrow. Namaste. I hope you enjoyed that meditation and stretch. Don't forget to like, comment, let us know what you thought, and subscribe to our channel for amazing videos to come. You are wonderful. Thank you for being here. Have the best day or night ever.